Hi, grandkids. In today's book, My Puppy is Born, a young girl tells a story about getting a newborn puppy. In this book, the pictures are photographs. They're pictures taken with a camera instead of illustrations that are drawn or painted. Let's read My Puppy is Born by Joanna Cole, photographs by Margaret Miller. Guess what? The dog next door is having puppies and I'm getting one. There are lots of puppies inside her. Soon they will be born. I can hardly wait. When the day arrives, the mother dog goes to her box. The torn up papers make a soft nest. The mother dog's muscles work hard to push the first puppy out. The first puppy is coming. It is born inside a thin sack. The mother dog has torn open the sack with her teeth. Now you can see the newborn puppy. The puppy is still attached to its mother by a white tube called the umbilical cord. Before the puppy was born, it got food and oxygen through this cord. The mother has bitten through the cord. Now the puppy must eat and breathe on its own. The mother dog licks the puppy until it is all clean. Then it is time for a rest. Being born is hard work. At last, all the puppies are born. The mother dog stays close to them. She lets them nurse. She keeps them clean. She makes sure her babies have plenty of peace and quiet. The puppies are all wonderful, but I have decided this one is going to be mine. I think I'll name her Dolly. Dolly is very small. She weighs only a few ounces. Dolly can't see. Her eyes won't open yet. She can't hear either. Her ears are plugged. Dolly is too weak to walk. She can only crawl. She's not ready for solid food. She has no teeth. but she knows how to nurse already. If you put your finger in her mouth, she starts to suck. When her mother is near, Dolly crawls around until she finds a nipple. Then she starts sucking milk. Every day, Dolly grows. She is two weeks old now. Her eyes are open. Her ears have opened too. She is a lot bigger, but she still can't stand up all the way.
I want to play with my puppy, but mostly she wants to eat and sleep. She is busy growing, so I leave her alone. Now Dolly is four weeks old. She is strong enough to sit and stand. Then she takes her first steps. Soon she is running all over the place. When Dolly was born, she had no teeth. Now look in her mouth. The puppy's new teeth hurt her mother, so she won't let them nurse as much. The puppy's first solid food is baby cereal. At first, Dolly doesn't know how to eat. She puts both feet in her dinner. But after a while, she learns to eat neatly. Soon, all the puppies are eating dog food. Every day, the outside world looks more interesting. And now Dolly can get out of the box. All by herself. The puppies learn to play. They play with toys and other things. They play with each other. And they play with me. After all that playing, it is time to sleep. And sleep. and sleep. When Dolly is eight weeks old, she is ready to leave her mother. At last, I can take her home. I give her a dish. a toy, and a hug. Now Dolly is really mine and the fun is just beginning. Wow, this book really makes me want a puppy too. I love you guys. Hope you enjoyed the story. Bye.